to a secret place mm, where only the moon can see beyond the shores. So Target has the good guys. They got all the spring stuff. So these two are finally, or everyone's finally feeling so much better, guys. Yeah, so today we are going to be shopping for um 2020 decorations i don't even know what that means i'm pretty sure they're gonna have like mostly spring stuff out i'm sure i've already saw like i follow target on instagram and i've been seeing a bunch of like spring what do you mean you're not gonna come i never wanna come they're leaving the car by yourself yeah so i even matched them today they're both wearing like similar outfits because um i want to take them pictures i haven't taken them pictures in a while but anyways let me tell you guys what today's video is about so ever since we took down our christmas decorations our house has been very bare and i'm really kind of lost of how to decorate it but i was like you know what target when i go to target they will tell me how i'm supposed to decorate and also like home goods living spaces living spaces we like to go there because they have a really nice um section of decor for their decorations we get a lot of our throw pillows from there because they have really nice unique ones and sometimes like i don't know what it is about target with their throw pillows it's like either hit or miss <laughs> it's either a hit or miss for me <laughs> we still have a little bit of a lingering cough guys but other than that they're feeling great. Great and Great and more crazy than they ever been. Ah, thank you. <laughs> so I went to Bath and Body Works like a couple days ago. All their candles are full price right now, and I love Target candles because they're only like ten bucks for the big ones and like five dollars for the little ones. So I'm gonna smell a couple of these. I'm like really sensitive to you right now with like scents because a lot of them make me feel nauseous. Oh, mango coconut. I like this one. Can you smell it? Oh, that's pretty good. Color too, it's nice. Dude, I have the same one. I got it from Urban, but what? We finally have this now. That one's bigger. I know, I kind of like this one. <laughs> Look at the pillow. Now I don't know which one I want more. There's like a Valentine's Day one. I think the pink one. This one? Yeah. My little twins. They look like little twinnies. Yeah, this is way better, huh? Easier without the baby? You guys <laughs> He's a little stinker. Yeah, he's our, but he's our little stinker, right? It's definitely looking like they have a bunch of spring vibes going on. Oh, that's cute. I like this color. I don't know if I like BU or you're like sunshine. Or you feel like sunshine. Okay, go ahead and push your car. You can push your sister. These are actually so pretty. These are tulips, remember? Even these are really pretty. I bought one of these before and you guys, it gets sun damage within like three days. Like it will just erase everything. I don't know if it's supposed to be an indoor one, that's why. I don't know if I want this one or if I want this one. Because I am going to be getting a, like a lot of soft colors like this, but then I think it would be nice to throw in like a, a deep blue color. Which one do you guys think I should get? Blue or pink? Pink. Of course pink. Eat them a color, blue or pink? Which one for the couch? 
You know you're going to be the one using it mostly. Blue. Blue. I kind of like the blue too. Oh, let me see this pillow. That's nice. I do like this blush one. What do you think? Good. Good? I kind of like this. So I think the blue would look better. So we're going to put the pink back in. <laughs> blue. Just kidding, Emma. We're going to get all the pink too, okay? She's like, ah, traitor. Traitor. Stop. We're going to have pink. We have a pink pillow there. We got to mix the colors, girl. This is pretty. Stop. <laughs> <laughs> Whew, my life is so much easier with just those two for real. So we got some things for decoration, but I honestly picked up a bunch of household items that we needed. I got this super cute pillow. I'm obsessed with the color. Okay, guys, we just left TJ Maxx and Home Goods, and they were completely dry. Like I didn't like anything. There was nothing like calling out to me. They didn't really have a big selection. I feel like Target. Right now they have a ton of like spring things, they have like a ton of baskets, a lot of cute candles and stuff. But I feel like maybe these stores take a little bit more time to get all of those things in because it, you know, Christmas did just happen. So um, now we're going to go to TJ Maxx, but first I think we're going to go ahead and get some food because I'm hungry and I'm pretty sure they're hungry. Are you guys hungry? I don't know. Uh, um, Do you guys want something to eat? Okay. Yeah. Like what? Maybe. Well, what are we going? We're going to go to Living Spaces after this. What's Living Spaces? It's the furniture store. Yeah, so what do you guys want to eat? <laughs> Maybe we go to Panera Bread yeah, and get mac and, mac and cheese. Ooh, you guys got some bougie taste. All right, we'll see. Mac and cheese. <laughs> Right, guys so it is the next day i we ended up getting frozen yogurt taking kids pictures and calling it a day after that i was so tired especially because we had to make those double trips to target um so we're here at living spaces now and we have everybody with us say hi babe hey <laughs> hi we even have him with us too today huh crazy boy yeah, and he should be good here too because they have um, these really cool cars that he can go in, and he's so entertained with that. So, mm -hmm. um, this is the last little stop, and then after this, we're probably going to print out some pictures so we can finally do our gallery art wall. I think it's called photo gallery, but uh, yeah, we finally have to update the pictures. Those are like fall and Christmas theme, and now we're going to have like beach pictures up and like spring kind of photos. So, yeah, you ready to go? Oh, it's a nice table right there. You're tired. Well, we have a bigger ent entryway. That's a cute little bench to get. Right then. This is probably our next couch right here. Our next couch, babe. To all of us. A giant mirror. Oh, I should take a selfie since I'm here. Oh, these shoes don't go with my outfit. <laughs> No, I think so. Look at that. I can barely fit in my high waisted jeans. I look like an Oompa Loompa. Might be too big for us. Really splinter. No, it's not gonna give you a splinter. Yeah, I love this. I love the bed too. I just don't like these chairs. I feel like it's two the same color. I would get like black ones. Definitely black. Okay guys, so I'm back. I took a nap, I ate some dinner, and now I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys everything that I picked up. So this is basically gonna be, my whole, my plan was like a Target, Home Goods, um, TJ Maxx shop with me, but it turns out those two stores didn't work out for me. So Target has the goods, guys. They got all the spring stuff. They're always like so quick too with like the transition. I think like 
um, the last week of December, I already started seeing like Valentine's Day stuff going up and I was like, oh my gosh, they're crazy. But anyways, so I'll go ahead and show you guys the two pillows that I got at Living Spaces since that is not from Target. So we ended up getting this black one. This one's really nice because it's like not so dark, but it's like kind of like a dark jean type of vibe. And I feel like this ties in with this one, you guys. I can't believe I did this, but I repurchased this pillow because we had with this pillow, but Ezra, he just was so fascinated with these beautiful gold coins and he took off every single one. So I'm hoping now that he's a little bit older, he doesn't do that. I'm gonna try to explain to him, son, please don't touch too glittery gold coins on my pillow because I was obsessed with them. Like, look how cute it looks. With the gold coins, it just makes it look more fancy. Yeah, so here's the vibe, and I'll go ahead and show you guys the pink pillow that I picked up from Target. I feel like all these tie in together. See that? That all goes, right? Those look cute together. <clears throat> so for the couch, um, we always get a throw blanket every season, so I wanted to get one for the couch, and we chose the dark blue, so it could just tie in with the light colors, dark colors, and all that, so... I think, I don't know, I'm way too early, I know guys, please don't come for me. <laughs> so I just wanted a new change, I was tired of all those winter decorations, and I just want to bring on the 2020 vibe, you know what I mean? So, yeah, we got this really soft a blue blanket, and it's by Project 62. And also, you guys are going to be seeing part two within the next couple days. I'm going to be doing a clean and decorate with me. And you guys will be seeing how I put everything together, so... Um, I'm excited about that. I also got two wreaths while I was at Target. This one I think is by Hearth and Hand and I just like the greens and it has like really soft baby pink little buds in it. I thought this one's so pretty and I'm not sure where this one's gonna be. I don't know if it's gonna be on the outside or inside of our house. I want one of the wreaths to go in our kitchen. I always like to hang up a wreath on the kitchen. It just gives it more pizzazz, you know, more character. So I saw this one, and this one is by the brand Smith and Hawkins. So <clears throat> this one's like a white floral one. This is like, you could tell this one's like, they froze it, like it was real ones. And with these, you guys have to be careful because I'm pretty sure, I don't know if it says it, but it should warn you that these, <clears throat> I don't know about this particular one, but I got one before, like last spring, and it just faded so bad within like the matter of a couple days, so. I thought that was super annoying, so that's why I got the ivory color. There was this really pretty, like, vibrant... Oh, sorry. Why do I... Why am I acting like I just ran a marathon? I'm so annoying, sorry. Pink, vibrant color wreath. I really liked that one, but I was just so afraid to get it because last year, mine faded so quick and it looked all crazy because I didn't want to buy another one. I should have returned it, but I didn't, so... Here are some of the little... What do the people call these? Let's see. I don't really know. I guess filler for a vase. So I got this white one. There's just like these pretty white flowers. The pink one, it matches the wreath. I wanted to tie those in with the wreath. And I also got these. Really pretty. And I got another one of these baby pink little flower buds. I don't know what type of flower it is. I'm just saying flower buds. <laughs> I don't know what to call it. And I also seen this candle holder, which I thought was really cool because I don't have anything like this. I have one for Christmas time. It's like a Christmas tree with the candle holder, but I don't have anything for all year round. So this one's just really nice. It's like this glass and it has this gold stand at the bottom. So I ended up getting crystal floral. This one, you guys, if you're in Target, you guys should smell this one. This one, I feel like describes spring. Like if you smell it, it just smells like spring just so pretty and florally and I also got mango coconut this one's really nice too kind of gives me more of a summer vibe though could you guys see that am I just like tripping or it's nothing in focus they were only ten dollars each so I really appreciate that but the only thing about these they burn a little bit funky I had a couple of these before and just it kind of burns weird that's the only little con about it but other than that it's just a regular perfect candle and I randomly got these two shirts, not really part of home decor, but I guess I'll go ahead and show you guys. You'll probably see me rocking one of these shirts in the next video. 
you know, it gives me those spring vibes. So this one's just pink and it's like a sex in the city shirt. It's the shopping is my cardio. And I actually think that is so spot on to like me. I don't really work out. Shopping and cleaning is my cardio for sure. <clears throat> I know I should walk more, but. <laughs> and I also got this one by Fifth Sun. Just like this long sleeve floral top. Yeah, I thought I showed you guys that since I picked that up while I was at Target. Random got some white dish towels. All their towels were, what was it, like 10% off. So I got this gray one by Opal House. I definitely, ooh, I think I need to brighten you guys. But I got a pink one. I want to take advantage of the sale. It's probably not even that good, but <clears throat> I need a towel. So, you know, might as well get them when they're on sale. So I got another gray one. And I got a blue one for Ethan. So, yeah, got four towels. And this is kind of random, but while I was at Target, they were having a percent off. I was buy one, get one 50% off their bras. And I randomly just like was drawn to this one here. It's like this black one and this nude one. And I go home and I actually look at it and it says nursing bra. And I'm like, my butt would, would <laughs> be drawn to the nursing bras. I'm like, out of all the bras, I had to get a nursing bra. The last couple things I picked up were these fillers. It's like a vase filler. I probably get pick up a vase at Dollar Tree or something. I don't know. <clears throat> and I just thought the colors were really pretty and <laughs> choking a little bit. And the last two things I picked up while I was at Target are these little canvases. I'm not sure if both of these are going to work out, but I liked both of them. I just wanted to see which one would fit better or that is it for this Target haul. I hope you guys enjoyed watching. Definitely give it a thumbs up if you guys like these types of videos and Thumbs it up if you guys are excited for the next one because I'm going to be doing cleaning and a decorate with me. Yeah, so with all that being said, make sure you guys are subscribed. Turn on your post notifications to get notified every time I upload a new video. There's a lot of fun things I want to do, especially I'm already 12 weeks pregnant right now, guys, which is so crazy. Only like two more weeks and I get to find out the baby's gender. I can technically find out this Friday at 13 weeks, but I want to wait like an extra week just just for them to be 100% sure, you know? So I'm excited about those. I wanna do some old wife tales though. Gender predictions at home. So I'm planning to do that before I go to my ultrasound. I actually have an ultrasound at 13 weeks. No, in a couple days actually, yeah, three days. Oh, okay, sorry guys. I'm getting off topic here, but thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed today's video and to not, <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Thank you so much for watching and I'll talk to you guys in my next one. Bye.